Hey, this is Michael with Digital Media Pro. I'm going to do a quick tutorial on EditShare and Avid Media Composer and uh, the current 2019 uh, problem with third-party uh, storage. Um, through a little bit of research and uh, I figured out this workaround. Uh, it was uh, deep in the uh, Avid README file, um, but hopefully this helps you with any bin locking problems that you're having. Um, first of all, we want to connect uh, our drive, but first we have to set up our Avid style. Uh, and to do that, we just browse um, for the location of uh, the file, and it's just going to be under this Avid uh, Media Composer. So Windows Program Files, Avid Media Composer, and Media Composer. We'll select that and make sure Avid style is enabled. I'm going to mount this drive as my Z drive and I'm going to launch Avid Media Composer. And as you can see here, I'm on Media Composer 2019.6. Um, I believe 2019.8 is out and available right now, but uh, this problem uh, persists between all of the 2019 versions. So once Media Composer launches, um, I am going to find my test folder here. Uh, I'm going to start a new project and call it test5 and I'm going to open that project. Now it's going to say I have a uh, non-average storage system. Uh, would I want to enable this? Um, you're going to want to click yes uh, and, and in theory this should actually fix the problem but in reality that button doesn't do anything you're gonna need to come over to file go to settings go over to your project tab and come down to general and under general you're going to want to enable bin sharing on third-party storage um, this is what the button should do but actually doesn't do so I'm going to enable this it's gonna say it's gonna close all of my bins uh, I'm going to click OK, OK, and close this. So what would happen before is it would lock the bins and you weren't able to add um, footage to it. Uh, the only time that it would lock or uh, lock the bins to your system is if the bins were open during boot. And so this fixes that problem. So if I open this bin now, um, it should be unlocked. And you see the unlock key here. If I go and input something from my source, um, and I'll just open up some media files here. And I'm just going to link it quick. And I can save it. And now I can close the bin and reopen it. And it's still unlocked. Uh, and if I navigate to where the file is, I believe it's in test two here, um, the bin is locked here. And if I close it, come back, the lock file is gone. I open it, and the lock file is here again. So this should fix uh, any third party um, services that you have. Um, with with bin locking for Avid. Again, this is Michael with Digital Media Pro, and I hope you found this tutorial useful. Please like and share, um, and comment below if you have any questions.